to this. What am I supposed to do? There are a lot of what's, a lot of what's. If a person don't know what they are supposed to do, then they'll find themselves consumed with everything. I got to do something. I just, I got to be busy. I just, I just can't be still. Okay. And, and, the, and social media, uh, uh, the, the people that's using that technology for their own uh, financial gain, they're going to keep your time. They're going to keep you occupied. As a matter of fact, social media addiction is, is just like drug addiction. Uh, baby, let me, oh, you using, give me a phone somebody. This, this, this is addicted. There is no, I mean, you have access to uh, scriptures. You have access to word studies. We have access to tap into some knowledge that will benefit us. But most of the time, this right here is being touched, was it over 2,000 times a day? Over 2,000 2, times a day by the average person. Entertainment. Enter in and retain. I got to see what's going I got to post me something. I got to read something. I got to hear somebody. I got to listen to somebody. It's just on and on. So when, I mean, come on, y'all. Come on out of here. It was not, uh, the Father didn't give us these inventions for that. It was never invented for that, but there's an addiction. Addic and then you got all these people out here with all this knowledge about everything. I'm, I'm, a Torah, I'm afraid, not scared, but afraid of hearing uh, these couples talk about marriage relationship on social media. I am. I am. Because I know that somewhere in the crack somewhere, over in that corner over there, there's a love for money that's the real reason that person is on there, and they have to follow us to commercialize that channel to get that money. There's too much fake stuff going on out here, and guess what? This present generation is buying it because the present generation is a product of social media pre-social engineering. Our kids coming. You give them that phone, they lock. They lock. That's just like putting them in the corner and tell them and tell them to be still or turn the TV on. What, what's the difference? The difference is when we do them like that, when they grow up, they locked in. I'm not saying that we shouldn't use the tools, but we should use them properly and take them off so much of time that they are spending. Like if they being bad, whoop their butt. No, we got to give them a phone, though. Well, I don't believe in that. That's the problem. You want to change the laws. You can't change the laws. You can't change the laws of the government of the kingdom that has been designed to govern us. Well, my mama whooped me. I ain't whooping my children. You're rebellious, and you're going to uh, suffer the consequences of it. This guy, a, a doctor May was telling me about, and, and young people do that. They go rent cars for people, and then they tear the car up, then mess their stuff up. It don't make sense to me. I bet you if Dada was around, that wouldn't be happening. No, you ain't written nothing for who? Who? I ain't never heard of him. And that's your friend? I don't know him? Boy, if you don't get out of my face. Why am I here and then what am I supposed to do? Potential. Let me give you an English, uh, uh, since that English word potential is there. Uh, and we, you know, it has to do with actually gifts, our design. Uh, reveal our potential. Potential is having a showing, having or showing the capacity to become or develop into something in the future. Potential. What am I supposed to do? Our potential tell us what we're supposed to do. Our potential is a product of purpose. So everything we're talking about, you can put it in the bank of purpose and get a good draw off of it. Anytime. Everything we're teaching in this series. Potential is what? Potential is the having or showing the what? Capacity to become. I like, I like that. To become or develop something in the future. Now, look at uh, Barashit. How do I want to? Yeah, go to Barashit 1. Now, notice to become. That's the English definition. Having the capacity to become or develop something in the future. But see... That's the English definition, but the principle of the kingdom is this, that we were completed before we began. 
Our future is in our present. That, you gotta we got to change the way we think. Our future is not in the future. Our future is in the present. So the potential, the gifts, the power that's in us right now is present. 